Oh, here we go. <clears throat> well, good morning, everybody. Hi. Welcome to Spring Forest Qigong every day. I'll be your host this week. My name is Terry Lears, and this is about my sixth time being the host of Spring Forest Qigong every day. Uh, I'm really excited. Uh, I want to thank, first of all, uh, Jackie Grand, Master Jackie Grand, and I want to. Uh... Oh, hi, everybody. Welcome to Spring Forest Qigong every day. This is where we get a chance to practice the Spring Forest Qigong active exercises as developed by Master Chen Yi Lin, who I've studied with and under for the last eight, nine years. And uh, it's my pleasure to share what I've learned from Master Lin. And before we get going, I just want to remind you, uh, get some water light a candle or your incense, make yourself comfortable. And just know you, you just can't get this wrong because uh, your body's intelligence will guide you. It will show you the way of how to clear any blockages and excess energy that might be present in your life, either in uh, physical uh, blockages or emotions or addictions or, or things like that. So just remember, the intelligence will guide you. So as I mentioned, my name is Terry Lears. I'm a certified practice group leader, and I'm certified to uh, teach uh, Qi activation. And before we get going, I want to uh, do a shout out to my uh, Qi brother, Richard Baboni. Uh, he did a wonderful job last week. Uh, so grateful, so grateful to be uh, in this, this group of uh, certified practice group leaders, uh, instructors, uh, teachers of Spring Forest Qigong. Uh, I had the opportunity uh, recently to uh, give a talk on harmony, how I believe harmony is inevitable. And uh, it was when I was preparing for that uh, talk, that Qi talk, that I came to the uh, realization that uh, not only are we uh, guided by the uh, universe and our connection to the oneness, but we have this beautiful body that uh, I like to think of as uh, the most powerful and unique electrical appliance in the whole universe. And if uh, you're like me, I get kind of geeky on the technical things. And, uh, uh, and I realize that uh, if I'm this beautiful, we're all this beautiful, uh, 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 amalgamation integration of life force in the biofield and we have the ability with our hands uh, to uh, heal ourselves and others and uh, I like to think of uh, uh, our health is in our hands our health is within our fingertips and with that I, I mean that within our fingertips and our hands as we uh, practice spring force qigong as we massage our, our hands, our palms together, and as we use sword fingers, we use our hands as input devices where the chi enters and flows uh, uh, from the fingertips, palms, and uh, directly to our organs and uh, through our major meridians and collects in our lower dantian. But from that energy source within the body, the lower dantian is a reservoir of this immense uh, reservoir, unlimited uh, supply of chi. And uh, the chi helps to create changes, facilitate uh, openness, uh, creating new possibilities and uh, facilitates new responses. It's also a, uh, it allows us to, uh, heal ourselves with our hands. And I wanna share three different uh, tips that I've learned from uh, Master Lin and, and from the uh, Head to Toe Healing book. And one is, uh, I just recently used this and it was for a, a bloody nose. So I had a, a, a stuffy nose and somehow it turned into a, a bloody nose. And, and all you have to do, 
uh, because uh, the meridians to your sinuses and your lungs uh, and your heart and large intestine uh, are uh, uh, facilitated and they're uh, uh, directed and they're, they're uh, connected uh, through your hands. So I had a, a bloody nose on the uh, left nostril. All you do is just raise your hand, the opposite hand, and uh, and you just uh, you can uh, chant the the sound of C and do it for one minute and do it as needed, and uh, you could do it in the morning or or afternoons, and this will uh, seal up the. Uh, bloody nose and the, uh, the meridian, or not the meridians, but the vessels that are causing the bloody nose. So uh, that's one tip. And then another that uh, is uh, uh, really fascinating is uh, if you or someone else is uh, uh, experiencing aging spots on your, your hand, all you have to do is just take the opposite hand and circle circle on top of the, the hand. Uh, and again, you can, uh, uh, you can chant C, and you can also add in the healing messages, message of all channels are open. And you do this in the morning, five to nine a.m. or uh, three to nine in the afternoons. And, uh, and this, this is significant because this is where the, the chi of the yin and yang uh, energy meridians meet. So just try this and uh, see what happens. And the third is uh, I, I want to share with you is the uh, uh, a real simple one for any kind of uh, pain or uh, aches. It's on the index finger and you can do this on both uh, hands and just with your thumb, just massage that bone from the index finger going back an inch and a half and just massage two minutes per hand as needed. And uh, again, you can give the healing message of pain is gone, aches are gone, things like that. So that's uh, Terry's tips uh, for uh, uh, using your hands as uh, beautiful uh, devices or uh, accessories for creating uh, a healthy life, not only for you, but you can teach others uh, these little tips too. So let's begin. And also, before we begin, I, I want to invite you to let me know where you're watching from so I can update my map of the World Wide Web of Love Radiators. I know uh, many of you have joined me before and many of you uh, uh, have practiced with me on uh, the Spring Forest Qigong uh, 100 day practice. Uh, and uh, if this is your first time, just remember you can't get it wrong. And uh, let me know where you're from and, uh, and let's begin. And as we begin, just begin bouncing, fingers wide open. And just begin bouncing at the knees, shaking off any stress, any unnecessary energy, raising hands above the head, breathing in through the nose, exhaling through the mouth, shedding, separating, letting go, letting go of any stress. Imagine that you're reaching over and, and turning down the volume of the monkey mind as you begin to become present with your breath, become present with your body. And turn off the monkey mind. Letting go, setting free, anything that might be causing stress and rubbing our palms together. 
And tapping underneath the eyes. Hmm. Totally present. Uh, and between the eyebrows and temples uh, and top of the head here. And back of the head. And let's give our attention and love to our C7. Lubricating, liberating, allowing the energy to flow from the head all the way down to the tip of the spine. And inside of the left arm, elbow, left arm. Likewise on the right side and armpit. And let's give our love and attention to our hips, top of the leg, boom, back in the pelvic girdle. Then softly, sweetly, just tapping the tailbone gently with the back of the soft fist, moving up to the kidneys. Love your kidneys. Cupping the kidneys, tops of knees. And sides of the knees. And let's complete this preparation to accept, preparation to surrender, and preparation to just yield to the magnificent, precious gifts of the universe as we sink into our heart, become present with our intention, our prayer, our dedication for our practice today, either for ourselves, each other, our family, our world. And with that deep appreciation for the universe, we invite our master and feel the presence within our heart and all around us. We place a smile on our face and feel that smile within our, our heart and our whole body. We now say the password that takes us from the threshold into the, the oneness. I am in the universe, the universe is in me. The universe and I combine into one. Mm softly, sweetly, just see yourself dissolve into the oneness. No limits, no conditions, no separation. Breathing in through the nose, exhaling through the nose and feel that gravitational pull from your lower dantian attracting your left hand and that pull or your right hand in front of your face as you now begin breathing in, accepting and visualizing the unlimited, unconditional stream of glorious light streaming into your lower dantian. Streaming in waves accompanied by the beautiful emotion of happiness. And with every breath, just feel 
the happiness streaming in, circulating freely, washing away all that excess energy is no longer loving, no longer worthy of you, no longer supporting or necessary to see it dissolving and returning to the native nothingness beyond the ends of the universe. And with every breath, you feel more renewed, more restored, more refreshed with the infinite supply of love and light. It is your birthright. I now feel that magnificent pull from your lower dantian as your hands gravitate as if drawn by a glorious magnet from your lower dantian and just begin like guiding your hands out with your elbows and exhaling. Taking in luscious, glorious sense of joy. Feel it streaming in as you see yourself, this beautiful infinite ocean of joy and love. With every breath, it gets stronger and stronger. With every breath, this joy goes deeper and deeper within you. Passing through your organs, your tissues, your bones, going deeper into your cells, molecules are saturated with beautiful joy. Every atom is glistening, it's precious light. Every atom, electron, the spaces between have so much joy, so much love. The more you receive, the more you want. The more you want, the more 
the universe provides. Just see yourself. Listening, illuminating, emanating joy to the ends of the universe. Without exception, without limits, no constraints. You radiate unconditional love, unconditional joy, and with one more. Feel drawn to the heavens as you reach above your head. And imagine and see the swirling golden threads from the ends of the universe. Streaming in through your fingertips, streaming in, spiraling in through your crown. As you now begin to draw in the knowing of perfect peace. And feel the same peace spiraling up through the core of Mother Earth. Up through the soles of your feet, your legs, your abdomen, your torso. Beautiful peace taking over. And returning you to the state of perfect oneness and harmony. Just allow yourself to be guided by the rhythm of the heartbeat of the universe that is within you. So you now feel the pull to your lower dantian as you join your fingertips together and place them just softly, sweetly out side of your lower dantian and take a half step out. And when you're ready, just inhale and surrender to that beautiful rhythm of the heartbeat of the universe that resides within you, deep behind your lower dantian. It's that permanent reminder and presence. of the oneness, just follow it freely without question, without hesitation. Perfect contentment is what you feel Perfect, precious, everlasting contentment. 
is that hand. Just feel the gentle rocking as if you're in the bosom of a loving mother with unconditional love for you in all things and with one more. Focus on your heart as you draw your foot back in and hands, heart center. And gently, sweetly, softly, just recall, remember all the blessings from today, the past, the future you now just bow in deep gratitude to you. reflect recall each blessing no matter how small no matter how faint. Just now you are loved. You are blessed. You are one with the universe. And now, So we now conclude our moving meditation. We want to harvest, shield, protect, and, and honor this beautiful chi that is now resident within our lower dantian. And just rub the palms together and massage your lower dantian in just a clockwise fashion and, and see that loving illumination of light getting brighter and brighter, yet smaller and smaller. So it turns into a beautiful diamond and you place it on a beautiful altar deep behind your lower dantian. Place it on the altar that is within the temple of you and set it aside as a, a permanent reminder that you are the universe, the universe is in you, and the universe and you are, are one. And let's massage our face and shape the heart as we come to the conclusion. Ah, just noticing what you notice, be aware, and just receive. Receive the continuous stream of blessings and and be guided by the intelligence as it continues to flow and circulate freely and expand and rub our ears together. Uh, tap your head gently, sweetly. And inside of our left arm. Wow. And the outside. And likewise, wow, oh, beautiful. So I wanna thank you, whether this is your first time or your hundredth time of attending uh, Spring Force Qigong every day. Uh, let me know where you're from. Let me know what your favorite uh, five active exercise is, and uh, let me know where, 
where you are in your development. But as we conclude, uh, let's bow to each other. Let's honor our masters, our lineage, our community. Let's recognize the, the universe within each and every one of us. And above all, honor and send blessings of love to yourself. As we now conclude and uh, can't wait to see you tomorrow. I'll share three more tips about how your health is in your hands, your health is at your fingertips. So have a beautiful day, everybody. And uh, if you're watch watching this on replay, I hope you enjoy it. So bye-bye, everybody.